Okay, we just got to New York. We're in our hotel room. First thoughts of our hotel room. It's spacious for New York City. Yeah, and we had a really good flight. We had a very smooth flight. And we got in easily and well, kind of. 30 times square is not easy. But. No, the taxi ride made me really car sick, but I expect that every time we come. Um, my outfit, I kind of, I just wore this one piece. It's black, really cute. And then I had a little small jacket over the top. And we're just getting ready. And we are gonna go get some 7th Street Burger, which we are very excited about. Yeah. <sighs> so we've made it, we're very happy we're here. And yeah. Very excited. We are going to see Hades Town after this, and mom's going to see a different one. Um, but we're gonna eat some yummy dinner. Okay, we are back at the hotel. I have my dress on. We are going to see Hades Town. Um, we rested for a second. I can show kind of a full of my dress. I don't know if I did it earlier, but Ralph Lauren dress. So cute. And I have it with my Tory Burch shoulder bag. And we are so excited. Um, we're really tired because it's been a long travel day, but we're very excited to go see Hades Town. So we're going to walk there. It's about a 10 minute walk. Okay, we just made it to Hades Town. We're trying to be quiet for the people around us. But we got really good seats and we're really excited, so I'll turn the camera around. Good morning. It's very loud. The sounds of New York, we love it. Um, it's like, what, 8.30 probably? Yeah. We're going to get bagels. We haven't gotten ready for the day because we just wanted to go get breakfast. And then we're gonna come back and or we're gonna go grab bagels and then come back and get ready for the day. So we're walking the crosswalk. It's about a 10 minute walk, so not too bad. Kind of excited to get a little bit of a walk in. So yeah. Air for air conditioning. <coughs> okay, we got back. We went to the Met and then Grand Central to eat. And then we came back and we rested. And now we are ready. We are going to Sweeney Todd and we are so excited. And then I'm wearing this dress. I don't know the brand. I got it from Rent the Runway. Um, and it's very pretty and flowy. Matt, where's your shirt from? Kohl's. Okay, and your pants? Kohl's. Kohl's sponsor Matt. Going to see Sweeney Todd, and we're so excited. <laughs> okay, 
Good morning. We didn't end the vlog last night. We left Sweeney Todd and it got done like pretty late around 11 and then we got pizza for dinner and didn't get back around like 12 so we were really tired and just went straight to bed but it is Saturday morning and we have a very busy day we're going to Brooklyn to eat at this place called Emily's and then on our way back up we're kind of we're gonna stop in Soho and do a little bit of shopping and see where the day takes us so i will show my outfit really quick so my top is this cute little crop top it's from abercrombie and my pants are from madewell and then i'm just going to pair it with my new balance um 550s um so i can be really comfortable when i walk matt do you want to show your outfit Okay, where's your shirt from? Uh, it's vintage. Okay, and the shorts? Uh, the shorts, they're from Target. Yeah, so we want to be comfortable today. So we just, the hotel room is very dirty, ignore that. Um, we are just going to do that, and then tonight we're going to see Parade, and we are very excited. So... We made it to the subway, to Brooklyn. It's very loud, it's very hot, we're excited. Yay! But well, we came to Emily's in Brooklyn and it was so, so good. Mom, how was your food? What'd you get? And she rates it a 10 out of 10. For sure, best burger in New York. Yes. And I had the Brenda, and it was a vodka sauce pizza with banana peppers and pepperoni. And it was so good. And Matt also had the burger. He rates that a 10 out of 10. So, altogether, a very good experience. We would recommend coming to Emily's in Brooklyn when you come to New York. So, we're going to get back on the subway and head to Soho and do a little bit of shopping and just see where the day takes us. switching hotels and we are going to be staying in a Central Park hotel for a couple days. We were staying in Times Square while we were seeing all of our shows because it's just more convenient but we are switching hotels and we are going to head to brunch in at Bobo. I think that's in the West Village. I'll need to recheck. Um, and then after that we're going to go to the Grand Bazaar flea market which we're very excited and yeah so we'll show our outfits. Matt, where's your top from? Abercrombie. Pants. Drifted. Okay. And then Stompus. Okay, Haley, where's the top from? My top is from Madewell. My skirt, it's actually a skirt, it has um, shorts underneath. It's from Abercrombie. Oh, then I have my New Balance 550s on. Um, and then I just have my hair in this cute little slick back bun because it is too hot to wear your hair down here. So. Yeah. Okay. okay, we 
just got back from Bobo, which was in the West Village. It was really cute and the food was good. We just got to Parkland Hotel in Central Park. Our room isn't ready yet, so we are just waiting in the lobby and it is super cute little area that we're sitting in. So we are just resting really quick and then Matt and I are gonna go to the Grand Bazaar flea market and look around. So we're excited, but the food was really good and we don't have plans for dinner tonight. So we will see where the night takes us. Okay, we just got to our other hotel. It's in Central Park, and our view is insane. We're at the Park Lane Hotel in Central Park, and we went to the flea market and got a couple things. I got this really beautiful vintage watch, as well as a cute little homemade necklace. Um, and then we stopped at Chip City and got some cookies for later and we walked back. It was like a 30 minute walk to the flea market so we're exhausted. And then we have an 8.30 dinner reservation tonight. So I think we're either gonna rest or find something else to do. Good morning or afternoon. Um, we got up at four. And I got my hair and makeup done and then we went and took engagement photos in Central Park in the West Village and it was so fun but it was so early in the morning and we were exhausted so that lasted until about 10 a.m. and then we went and grabbed breakfast, came back and then took a nap um, to get some energy for the rest of the day so we just got re-ready. And we are going to go shop on Fifth Avenue for a little bit. And then we have a dinner, reserva a dinner reservation in the West Village tonight at 7. So that'll be so fun. But I haven't vlogged at all today, so I'm going to try to be a little bit better. We're so excited to go shopping. Um, again, this is our view. Astounding. And we took most of our pictures at Bethesda Fountain. And that was really fun. Our photographer, her name is Asia. She was amazing. Yeah. We could not have asked for a better experience. We were so excited to get those pictures back. Okay, shirt. Vintage. Pants. Uniqlo. Okay. And then just, okay. My dress is from Rent the Runway. I, like I don't that. know. I'm re-wearing this. I wore this to a Broadway show, but I really wanted to just wear this shopping today. Okay. My necklace is from the Grand Bazaar Flea Market. And then my earrings are from Amazon. Both both ones are. Cute. My makeup is from Lucy from Makeup Masters to You on Instagram. Like that. It's this company. Um, they'll travel to you. They do like New York, New Jersey, Philadelphia, stuff like that. They come to you if you're traveling and need your hair and makeup done. So they were amazing. They came at 5 a.m. to get me ready, which was so fun. Um, and then I'm either going to wear my Reebok sneakers or my New Balance 550s. So awesome. we're ready to go shopping. Okay. yesterday because we just kind of wanted to it was our last full day and we just wanted to enjoy the day but we had such a chill day we went to a french bakery for breakfast and it was really really good um and then we kind of just chilled and we got 
Joe's Home of Soup Dumplings for lunch, which we had last time we were here and it was so good. And then we went into Central Park and watched the sunset, which was so beautiful. And then we had Joe's Pizza for dinner and it was a very, very yummy. But this morning we have a breakfast reservation at Sarah Beth's, which is right next to our hotel. And then we are heading to the airport. We are going to Buffalo, New York to see Niagara Falls. We were supposed to go to Canada, but my passport was expired and we didn't realize it until last minute. But we're still gonna go see the falls, just on the Buffalo side. So it's only about an hour and a half flight, so we're excited to be there tonight. And then tomorrow evening is when we'll fly back home. So we're feeling a little homesick, but we love New York so much. We can't move, wait to move here um, and call this place our home. But for now, our home is back in Arkansas. So we are ready to get back. Um, it's been an exhausting six days, but so fun. And we have fit so much into this trip and had such good food and such good time shopping. Um, but this is the view we're saying goodbye to. So sad, so beautiful. But we're just gonna go eat breakfast and then head to the airport. Hello, this is the next day. I filmed yesterday morning that we were going to Buffalo see Niagara Falls and then I filmed on the plane and then I didn't film anything else so we got there at like five or six ish and then we saw Niagara Falls and then we went to eat dinner at the Western Steakhouse which was inside of the Seneca Casino and then we played some slot machines which was really fun and I took a video of us doing that so that was super fun and now we are at the Buffalo Airport. It is like, what, one o'clock? Yeah. About one o'clock. We're about to board our flight to LaGuardia. And then we have like a two hour layover in LaGuardia. And then we are going back to Little Rock, which we're excited about because we're really homesick. It's been seven days that we've been on vacation and it's been a long time since we've been on vacation for that long. So we're tired and we're ready to get home and ready to get these flights over with. Um, but surely the day will go pretty fast. We had Tim Hortons for breakfast. It was good. I had a sausage, egg and cheese bagel, and it was good, but it had too much egg on it, which I feel like we both agree on. Yeah. There was too much egg, but it wasn't like awful. It was obviously edible. And then we shared a 10 pack of the variety Timbits, which those are really good. How'd you like the Timbits? They were good. They were good. So we're gonna, He's looking forward to Shake Shack once we get to the LaGuardia Airport. And then if I can't find anything else, I'll get Shake Shack, but I'm not really feeling Shake Shack this time around. So hopefully I'll find something else in the airport once we get there. Hello, it is me again. We are at the end of this vlog. I'm obviously back home from our New York trip, but I was just gonna do a little haul of everything I got while I was in New York, cause we had so much fun and I got some really good, cute stuff that I'm excited about and I just wanted to share. So the first thing I got, obviously had to get one of these I Heart New York shirts to sleep in, cause they are iconic and honestly i got this from the laguardia airport and i was not expecting it to be this comfy but it is a really amazing sleep shirt and it's actually super comfortable the next thing i got from the laguardia airport is this new york city hat like beige and i think it'll be super cute for the fall with like um the embroidery is navy so i was thinking like an oversized navy sweater would be really cute um just fall vibes so super cute and then also from the Liberty Airport, I've been to New York multiple times, but this was honestly my favorite time that we've been. We just had such a great time and we're getting closer and closer to us actually being able to live there. So I got this keychain. It's so cute. It has the I Heart New York um, Apple with NYC on it. It's got 
picture of kind of the skyline with Lady Liberty in it. And then it's also just got this, it just says New York. And it's so cute and I, it's super light. I didn't want to get anything that was too heavy for my keys, but I'm so excited to put this on my keychain. Um, also from the airport, I just got an I Heart New York mug. Super iconic, just needed one. We've gone so many times and I've never gotten any of the I Heart New York stuff, which is just so fake of me. So I just had to get one. Fall's coming up, hopefully soon. So I'll be able to use it. So first from Aritzia, I just got the um, Tina socks. I have, I got a three pack. I've already worn them so much. They're so comfortable. They're so worth the hype. Um, I'm already need to order more just because I want to be wearing these every single day. And they're super cute. Um, like a super good length for sneakers. So super cute. Next from the Adidas store, I got these Adidas Gazelles, which I'm so excited about. Um, they're like this peach color and they have the gold lettering. I think these are also going to be super cute for fall with jeans and a gray sweater, just anything for fall. So I'm super excited about that. Ralph's Coffee was having a had a pop-up truck that we walked by when we were walking past Rockefeller Center. So we went and got something to drink because it was so hot and they were also selling merch. So I got this tote bag that is a Ralph's Coffee tote bag and it is so cute. Um, and at the bottom it says Ralph Lauren NYC. So I'm super excited to have that here at home. I'm always in need of a tote bag to carry things around. So I'm super excited to have that. Next from Saks Fifth Avenue, I'm so excited. I got a Skims set. So I got the boxer shorts in this brown. Oh my goodness, I've already worn these to bed. They are so soft. I cannot wait to buy another pair. And then I just got the matching like kind of oversized shirt to sleep with it. And they are both incredibly soft. They're so worth the price tag. And they're so um, affordable for such a high-end brand. So I would definitely recommend those. I am putting them on my Christmas list to get a um, different color. So I'm very excited about that. Next, I got um, two things from Aerie. I got these pajama shorts, which are the cutest thing ever. And they're so comfortable. I can't wait to wear them. And then I also got this, their Halloween stuff was already out and I'm so excited. I got this oversized tee and it is so cute. I cannot wait to wear this in the fall with biker shorts or just jeans and a cardigan. So I'm very excited about that. I thought that was super cute. And then I also from the LaGuardia airport got a, just a New York sweatshirt just to have to wear around the house. Super cozy, super oversized. So I'm excited about that. Lastly, from the Buffalo airport while we were there, I got this shirt that just says enjoy Buffalo, the good life, New York. Um, I kind of got all these shirts and stuff from the airport just as like memories and keepsakes. Um, I'll most likely wear these just around the house or as PJs. But I am so excited to just have something to remind me of how amazing this trip was. So that is going to be the end of this vlog. Thank you so much for watching. I have so many video ideas for the next couple of months that I cannot wait to post and film. So stay tuned and I will catch you guys in the next video.